Hi, welcome to the Big Bear Homestead. And today, we're talking predator control. Hi, I'm Jason from the Big Bear Homestead. And if this is your first time here, and you wanna learn about everything homesteading, whether it's animal husbandry, gardening, predator control, canning, Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and don't forget the bell. All right, well today we're gonna to talk about predator control. Well, what is predator control? And why do you need it being a homesteader? Well, we like to refer to predator control here on the Big Bear Homestead, we like to refer to it as the Voldemort of homesteading. Nobody likes to talk about it. It's the he who should not be named of homesteading. Predator, when you're dealing with predators and predator control, has to probably be about the ugliest thing in your whole homesteading lifestyle. Because, let's be honest, when you're dealing with a predator, that means you're losing something. You're either losing eggs, chickens, calves, vegetables, fruits. You're losing something from a thief. And so over the next couple of videos, we're going to talk about how to deal with these predators on your homestead. Whether we're talking about food barriers, deterrence, trapping, all those things that we're going to talk about over the next couple of videos. Because trust me, just because you haven't had a predator yet, doesn't mean you never will. So predator control is definitely a tool every homesteader needs in their toolbox. Now, up in cards and at the end of this video, we're gonna link some of our older predator control videos where we went in depth with certain predators like the possum, the raccoon, snakes, mice, raptors, coyotes, your canines, your cats. All of those, we went into depth a couple years back and gave you guys a lot of good information in those videos. But in this next series that we're, we're gonna we're gonna kind of switch it around a little bit and we're gonna talk more about food barriers, deterrence. We're gonna focus in on how should you build your chicken coops or chicken tractors. There's no such thing as a 100% proof, predator proof chicken coop or chicken tractor, but there are certain things that you can do that will deter predators from coming to your to try to get your eggs or your birds now if you have a population boom there's not too much that's going to stop them and that's when you got to pull out your traps and we're going to go over the traps and stuff that you need as a homesteader to be effective with predator control well i hope you guys look forward to this series and i hope you guys find this series informative and useful don't forget to check us out on all of our other social medias and don't forget about our website where you can go and purchase these, some of these traps that we're going to be talking about in the next couple videos. Thanks for coming by the Big Bear Homestead and like always, have a nice day.